I've seen some amazing sporting talent and some really great dancing talent as well. So I'll give them a round of applause. So, my name is Thomas Henry, and today I'm going to tell you a little bit about my life and my type of career. Hopefully I will give those of you who are worried about where life will take you after school a new way of looking at the future. And to those who are eagerly awaiting the end of your time at school, I'm sure you'll find it equally as useful. At the age of 10 years old, I was um, diagnosed with Asperger's syndrome, something I'm sure many of you know about. But a few years into secondary school, I was starting to find everything a little bit too overwhelming for my own good. I dropped out of sports classes, I stopped meeting up with my friends, and I was spiraling down into a bad place. I was tired. I was tired of the bullies at my school that were giving me a hard time. Tired of feeling worthless. Tired of retreating to my room every night. Hoping that a fizzy pop and sweets and movies would solve my problems that I was having. Although the movies I watched every night were a little bit of a waste of time, I found myself gripped to a few characters. Usually those who were a little bit misunderstood, weird, are strange, but always the ones who succeeded and surpassed everybody's expectations of them. With no real role models I could properly connect with, these heroic and determined characters were my source of inspiration in these dark times. So I decided to join the Taekwondo Club at the age of 15 and quickly found myself progressing through the belts and gradings. I practiced every night. I would exercise and perfect my kicks at any opportunity that I had. I joined a competitive Taekwondo club where I found myself, despite having poor self-confidence, fighting and inspiring with some of the best fighters out there. I started competing, climbing the ranks and belts, and eventually found myself at the national championships, where I slowly made my way up to the gold medal position over the course of three years. After that, I started competing in, in countries abroad like Croatia, Spain, Serbia, and I was eventually picked up by the Great Britain squad for my talents. Very soon, I was invited to attend the Under-21 European Championships and the Commonwealth Games. In the European Championships, I placed fourth, losing only to the eventual gold medalist. In the Commonwealth Games, I placed first, winning an award for that being the best male fighter of the competition. All of this did a lot for my confidence. And this confidence led into other areas of my life. It was my life in this very confusing world that I was living in. I studied hard in my A-levels. I went to a Russell Group University. And I even lived in Thailand for a year researching mosquitoes uh, in the lab and travelling around Southeast Asia for two months with nothing but a backpack. Now I found myself a part of two documentaries, uh, documentary films, going on radio shows, succeeding on YouTube and even working with the BBC on a few projects such as podcasts and videos. For me, my inspiration came from the anime and movie characters I've looked up to all these years. All I really wanted to feel is that my life had meaning at the time, and the problems that I was facing at school and in daily life were not for nothing. Hopefully, my words today have inspired some of you to tackle what you fear head on, succeed in whatever you see fit, and show the world that just because you aren't the typical example of a strong and successful person, you will succeed and you will do it in your own unique way. Thank you.